The 2ZZ manual says for finding top dead center for piston 1, rotate the engine until the two timing marks on the cam sprockets are slightly off center to each other. I verified that the teeth on the sprocket are both engaged in the chain and that there are nine links between them. I used a flashlight and looked down the spark plug hole to see if I could see the top of the piston is very close to the hole, which it was. To make sure the valves are closed for each cylinder, just make sure the lift part of the camshaft is not touching the rocker. As long as it's the base circle touching the rockers, the valve will be closed. After measuring cylinder 1, just keep rotating the engine until another set of camshaft lobes gets lined up. I rotated the engine by putting it in first gear and rocking the car forward. This caused the engine to slowly rotate. For the leak down tester, I unscrew the regulator so that it zeroes out. Slowly screw in the regulator until the leakage gauge reads 0%. Slowly open the valve so that the air can go into the cylinder. The leakage gauge stabilizes at about 20%. I then redo the operation just to make sure. Each cylinder came in at about 20 to 25 percent rate. 